This one time last year, I was dyeing my hair outside because I dye my hair outside because I'm messy. My dog kept coming over and whining at me, so I threw a whole bunch of hair dye on him. Don't worry, I made sure I was safe before that because I was thinking about dyeing him because that would be really cool. And so I ended up just dumping a whole bunch of purple haze and after midnight blue on him and like squishing it around there. And he thought he was getting a bath, so he just, when he was done, he went and rolled around in the grass because that's what he does when he's all wet. And yeah, then I let him run around for about an hour or so while it set in in the backyard and he played. And then I washed him off and he didn't like that part because he doesn't like getting wet. And that's okay. And my parents got mad not because he was purple, they didn't mind that. It was the part that uh, the sun went down and it got really dark and so it got cold. And he was cold outside and purple and they said, never do it again. But whatever, because you know he really liked it because he's like an attention hog and all the little kids came over and they wanted to pet him more and more because uh, he was purple and that made a lot of people smile so he was like, oh this is ace, these people they are coming over and I don't know why but I liked it. Yeah, I'm dumb because I only got pictures while I was doing it so it was super super purple and then a few weeks later after that was pretty much only faded but you can see splotches because the purple haze that I used was gel so it kind of stuck in certain places heavier than the other stuff and after midnight blue was just like ant cream so yeah it's actually the same stuff I was using on my hair at the same time the trick is you put a little purple in there with your blue and it won't fade to green so